are so glad that you can join us today. In today's video, I want to talk about this little tail. Who would ever know that when you're getting to know a kitty and learning how they communicate, you learn to pay attention to that little tail. Those little tails have a lot to say. Their little ears do as well. Let's take a look at what that little tail says today. So Nuffy's little tail right now is really relaxed looking. We do have some doggies barking, but so far that hasn't upset him. So when you see a little tail that's relaxed like that, that's a good sign that they're feeling good. Sometimes you'll see it curled like this to their side and very relaxed like that. Now the little tail is just starting to peak interest in that barking. But when it's loosely relaxed around their body, that also shows that they're relaxed and that they're feeling good, that they're feeling safe. Now the little tail is starting to pick up Oh, oh, that, that was impatience. This little tail now is impatient. When you're seeing it like that, a lot of times they kind of point it down a little, but sometimes you'll see them also stick it straight up and they'll just swish, swish, swish like that. And they'll thump things, like thump your leg, or they might thump the furniture. That's showing impatience. Now, if his tail were sticking straight up and were lightly moving like this, just very just very lightly on the top that would show that he had he had things that he was interested in that would show a curiosity the kitty would be wondering what's going on in this world yes a lot of times when he's a little squirrel like his eyes look almost right here <laughs> you'll see that little tail really really stick up straight especially when he's going to jump and there is a little playful tail here that's just lightly moving back and forth. That's playful and interested. He wonders why I keep filming his tail and not his pain. Oh, look at this. <laughs> that little tail will stick straight up when he's about to jump somewhere. It's so cute. Yes. If this little cutie pie, I wish I could catch this one on film, but he sometimes makes a full question mark with his little tail. He almost is there. Like, he's curious about the world, like he's going, hmm, Reggie boy. Look at this little rabbit footsie foot right here. So if you're ever seeing them, like, slouch down really low, if you're seeing it, like, kind of straight out and moving a little bit, and they're hunkered down, and they've got the little squirrel face, the little focused, I'm going to jump face, then, and their little hips are kind of gathering energies for them to jump. Yes, so those little rabbit footsies can jump. And that little tail will tend to be flat and just swishing a little back and forth. On the other hand, if you ever see them hunkered down, looking, and intimidated looking and then the little tail and the little tail is really stiff and like down in between their legs or down by one side that shows that they're not happy they're scared and then the other of course is if they're laying down and the little tail is loose that means they feel safe they're relaxed if that little tail is stiff that means they're not feeling as safe those little tails though they communicate so much. <laughs> this little tail is interested in what he's doing. If you're ever seeing a really poofed up tail that's like three times the size, it looks about like the width of my hand here, that and the hair is all standing up on end. They feel threatened. And a lot of times that's going to be when they have like a rival kitty or a bigger type of animal. They'll instinctively poof the hairs on their back or their tail up like that. And if you ever see that, know that kitty doesn't feel safe. And that, you know, if, you're, if your kitty's doing that, they're not happy right then. Those little tails just have so much to say about you. You just say so much through your little tail, don't you? Yes. <laughs> Thank you all so very much for sharing this time with us today and watching the video. I hope that this helps bring some fun and learning into your lives about your precious kitties or any other kitty that you happen to meet. Well, thank you all so much. If you like the content of our videos, don't forget to take those paws. 
and paw just like a button. You can paw the subscription button and you can paw the notification bell to get more videos from him. Well, thank you all so very much and we look forward to seeing you in the next video.